And now we're also following breaking news in Alachua County. A two-year-old boy was killed when he was attacked by two family dogs. His grandmother was injured. The tragedy was this morning in High Springs on Northwest 210 Avenue, about a 90-minute drive from Jacksonville. News 4 Jax reporter Eric Avigny just got to the scene. Eric, what have you been able to find out about how this happened? Well, the home where the attack happened is just at the end of this private driveway here. Uh, this is as far as we're allowed to get close to the property. I can tell you that just after 1030 this morning, someone inside the home called 911 about two people being attacked by the family dog. When paramedics arrived, they say they tried to save a little boy who was attacked, but they say he died inside the house from his injuries. Investigators say the boy's grandmother fought off the animals, but had to be rushed to the hospital with serious injuries herself. Now, Animal Control describes the dogs as being an American Statford, Staffordshire mix and a chocolate lab mix. Animal Control has both dogs now. They'll be held for 10 days for a rabies evaluation since the grandmother survived the attack. After 10 days, both dogs will be euthanized. And we're also just getting some new, other new information that's just coming into us. We've now learned that there was actually a total of six dogs on the property back there. Uh, but again, only the two attacking dogs are the ones that are being held um, again uh, in isolation but they did take all six but the two that were the attacking dogs those are the ones that are being held in isolation and those are the ones that after 10 days will be put down reporting live eric avignet channel 4 the local station